here is our environment definition uh, is done and then you see that, that you you cluster nodes and then there is a our our cluster names and then the enable uh, true false and true information and here is the your most important settings so we call the, our environmental settings and set the the path variables for the for the java home and then your your jar file information is important that this is our our application is here so here is the bar in the, the bar variables we set it here and there's the profiles so we we, we run the application in the development environment so it just you have to need to change it here if you are in the productions just proc and then if you are other environments rel or whatever it is change just you change it here and and you have to change your port number and your, your machine location or machine path number and then you have to change your cluster names and that's all and then it works automatically and here is our 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 the calling and you see the, our definition is done so the now before running the application because you have to run your 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 elastic search yeah yeah server so you have to run your elastic search fast very fast after running before running the the elastic <coughs> So elastic search has to be run first. <coughs> so it's and then after that you have to run your applications uh, to the to the this is you see that the, your definition is there and your start setup is there, their jar file is there, then just you need to run a uh, start 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 service and that's all, then the application has to be started. So let's see our 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 elastic search has to be started and then you have to be application it has to be done by your applications and and that's that's that has to be and now we try to our to to, to test our application with, with uh, google postman's you can use different ID like rest rest clients id or soap ui for testing your, your apis and i will give you to more detail about the postman uh, testing how we did it for this application for the for the for the testings <coughs> so you saw the application is running and then this is the your port and then tomcat and the user port number is is it here so initializer port 1035 and this is the your development environments and the application is successfully deployed to the development environments and the same things you need to to deploy the just you need to change your your machine port number machine name number and your your cluster name so it's this application is successfully successfully deployed and uh, successfully run in the in the top port number 1035 so let's have a start with the testing in postman so you saw that our <coughs> postman setup is there so i have a lot of projects uh, to to test it in postman you see a lot of projects where our 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 REST projects. So you have seen that our lot of test cases is there. So 21 request for the different URL and to the endpoints. I will show you how some part of the application how is done. The major part of the float crude operation for the for the applications. <coughs> then then that's why we, we said it here our application is deployed and and we, we can check up uh, because we application is running we can send up and then see the application status of the application <coughs> so is the application is up the tomcat is up so then then we have a different post then get post and and then let's have insert one application you see the our url plot info and your information and then let's see we need to to define here our applications our our objects so we said that the plot informations in here and then there is a plot has many building informations and there is only two only one building information is store and the plot has a multiple geolocations and geolocation one and latitude longitude and then some remarks and here is the the geolocation two and geolocation four that means in the in the in the in the plot has has multiple four buildings I, I think so so one two three buildings four buildings and he has a central coordinate for each of the of the buildings and there is a plot one to many uh, authentication informations and on the power content of the authentication information and then ownership informations is only mapped and then you can put it here in the payment informations and the utility informations uh, for the for the plot and the billing information
application for the for, for the plot. Just I put it here the one one screen, one of the test cases. So that's so let's let's have you start to put and then send it to the request. <coughs> and this is the application, the the report inserted properly. So as you see the the status two hundred one created and the, your 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 objects and here is the your your ID for the uh, for the primary key for the for the for, the, for this for the insert process and and then after that you can search uh, for the for the whole 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 report set for the <coughs> for your inserted records we did it previously uh, record more and you can see the all information is reported so a total is a total records five we already did it and hits and totals and information for the inform the, the plot information is here and the building information is here and then you have location utility information is here and then authentications ownerships payments utility and then and so on so forth for the information so it has five records and each of the record is, is there so it's is 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 really really so this tool is really flexible and really important tools for the for the rest api testing or restful web service testing even though you can soap ui is a good tool also depending on your company requirements or depending your requirements what is is good for you so here's the one of the record is a get specific uh, specific record uh, to to be up to be get Yes, the record is there. So 100, 103. So it's get the specific information. So get by ID, and then that's all. That's so, so on and so forth. So put, and you you change the the some some information 130, and maybe maybe just 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 change it to your code. Let's put it here. Code. Code. Hmm. Uh, blah blah blah. Love. And then maybe change something. <coughs> and then you put it your for push request and and, and it's, it's works automatically. It's it's, it's okay. The put is, is done properly. You see that your update is done. So you get your update and then you can change it what you would like to do so put is done and uh, you can post and you can delete some of the informations uh, maybe delete and 